It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Guys, we are back with another first 10 from the Geek Den. And man, this is awesome. We got Link's Awakening on the Nintendo Switch. Like, whoever thought that was going to happen, that they were going to recreate the Game Boy, one of the best games on the Game Boy Advance, and bring it out for the Nintendo Switch. And not only do that, but like proper, proper update, redesign everything. And it looks just stunning, just perfect. Like, cannot wait to get stuck into this one. So guys, please drop me a like and subscribe if you're enjoying this series. And let's get into it. What's with the graphic design? Looks amazing though. Is this is this the normal cutscene design? Wow. Ooh. That's stunning. Is it like an anime style? Yeah. It is like an anime style. I wonder if all the cutscenes will be like that. Word up, Link. Give him a kick. Wake him up. Uh, you can shake him. Shaking him is fine. What about slap? Just quick one. That's so amazing. You know what I think? I think the, the creators of these games are just so, so brave with their design choices because they are constantly chopping and changing the style, the design, keeping it fresh. It's amazing. Uh, are we gonna go with normal or hero? We'll go, we'll go normal for this one. We'll do normal. And a link, of course link. It's not like I'm gonna put from the geek then. Although I might put Zelda on there to troll a few people. I know how people get really annoyed with that. What a relief! Oh, Marin, that's the girl, right? I thought you'd never wake up. You were tossing and turning. What? Zelda? No, my name's Marin. You must still be feeling a little woozy. You're in Koholint Island. I think that's how you pronounce it. So a chat with there. Follow the lane south to reach the beach where I found you. Since you washed ashore, lots of nasty monsters have been in the area. So be careful, okay? And here's Wario looking like dude. Well, Link, you finally snapped out of it. Name's Tarin. Hope you're feeling better. What? How did I know your name? You think it's weird, huh? Well, I saw it on the back of this shield. Yeah! Awesome. You got your shield back. Hold R to repel enemies with it. That is a beautiful looking shield. I need to pick one of those up for the Geek Den. And the Master Sword. Nope. Oh, that's right, you can't actually lift in these games, can you? Until you get your, uh, I think it's a Power Glove. And you need a Feather to jump, which I believe you get later on, I think it's... Such a long time since I've played this game. Right, we're gonna have a little explore. Of Koholint Village, or whatever it's called. Just awesome, isn't it? It's like a little toy town. I love it. Well done, Nintendo. Really well done. Oh, if they've done as good a job with this game as I think they have. Could end up being one of the games of the year for me. I, I, I love Zelda. Down. There we go. Ooh, we did a little flippy that time. Ooh. What am I doing? Down to the beach. Okay. We go along here. Ooh. There she is. Block, 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 block. Down. Block. Oh, that was fortunate. <laughs> I was hoping that would work. Okay, there's a little sword there, dude. Let's go get him. Oh, 
Oh, the owl. So you are the lad who owns the sword. Now I understand why the monsters are starting to act so violently. A courageous lad has come to wake the windfish. It is said that you cannot leave the island unless you wake the windfish. Is there a reason why you used windfish twice in that sentence? You should now go north to the mysterious forest. I will wait for you there. Woo. Just in case you didn't realise he was an owl, he says hoot. As well as English words. And probably many other languages. You found your sword. It must be yours because your name's engraved on it. You can swing it with B to attack. Ooh, that's cool. You got nothing on me, crappy boy! That's the one. Ooh, five rupees. Let's go get them. I think they're five blue ones. Yeah. That's it. Not that I'm very good at the silly voices, but hey. I'd probably be less silly if I was. Mysterious forest is up here somewhere. So up to the village. Mabby village. Or maybe or maybe. Whatever that is. It looks so cool. What do you guys think of the design? I'm really impressed with it. And that misty, foggy edge they've got to everything. It makes it just look so fantasy. Who? Brave lad on your quest to wake the dream and welcome to the mysterious forest. Much of your mystery will you'll find this island, uncharted Kohalit Island. I'm afraid you may find it a trifle difficult to leave the island while the wind fish naps. By the by, <laughs> have you ever visited the tail cave which is south of the village? Nope. Go there with the key you find in this forest. Oh, that's fortuitous. The wind fish is watching. Ooh. Okay. Do this, Mr. Owly boy. Come on, Link. What we got? Oh, get him. Oh, get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. It's a block. We're using that block, so. Ah, that's an interesting one. So, if I don't let go of... Here's a tip for you guys. If you don't let go of the, uh, the block button... Ooh, hello, little thing. You can actually swipe and block at the same time. As a raccoon, my nose is very sensitive to powder and stuff. Okay, I'm gonna give for you a little racket. What are you doing? <laughs> You're gonna be lost thanks to me. Oh, that's right. Topsy turvy's everything, doesn't he? So long. Oh, hello. Oh, there's a fairy. Hello, little fairy. That's a cool little power. I like that one. I need to do that more. Ooh, another one of these guys. Let's get him. Oh, it's right to parry him or something. Okay. There you go. Little blobby dudes. Oh, there's two of them. I can have got my shield up. Uh, can't lift boulders. Five rupees. I'm earning my money. Right, let's go this way. I think. Um, this way. Nope, been that way. Right, this way. No. Um, that's so cool. Right, there's a log thing, log. Right, what's it? Okay. Right. Let's do this. Oh, it's lucky I got hit there. I would have fallen in otherwise. Right. Get you. Uh, you. Open you. Do -do -do -do. 50 rupees. Very nice. I'd like to buy it with 50 rupees. Get 
the little green blobby dudes. Let's go. Okay. So. So let me get this straight. I can push boulders. <laughs> but I can't lift a pot. Okay. And then, I'm all now. Get him. That's it. Hold that shield up. Come on, attack me. Take him forever. Do you take three hits? Doesn't normally do that. Okay, let's pick this up. And we've got a toadstool. As you hold it over your head, a mellow aroma flows through you. Oh, I feel mellow, which is good. Can't go that way. There's a little hole. Where do we go? Back this way. Right, so guys, that is just a taster of Link's Awakening. I am so excited for this game. I, I'm going to be doing a full playthrough on this. So guys, please like and subscribe if you're enjoying these. And yeah, if you want to see the rest of this this walkthrough series or playthrough series, whatever you want to call it, um, hit the little bell while you're there, because uh, then you'll get to see every single episode as it comes up. And this game just looks amazing. I think it has the potential, if Nintendo have done as good a job with it as I hope they have, has the potential to be a game of the year for me, or at least one of them. Um, yeah, so good. Just so good. Okay, guys, I will catch you next time. Hope you are all doing really, really well. All the best. Take care. Bye-bye.